Okay, dad gang, this is Martin, and I want you guys to check this out. So there's this girl named Lily K, and she's got receipts, y'all. Turns out, the boyfriend that she's been dating for almost close to a year has a secret relationship. But wait, it gets worse. The secret relationship is with his own biological sister. And don't you worry, guys, because I got all the tea so that you don't have to waste no time hearing the whole story. So Lily meets this guy. We're gonna call him Tommy. And basically almost a year ago, they end up talking from a dating website. And as they get deeper into their relationship, guys, he becomes her first everything. First kiss, first date. You guys know what I mean. But then sooner or later, guys, people started to tell her that Tommy's weird and that he's crazy. But she didn't believe them because she felt like people always talk negative about people. And nine times out of 10, they're not true. What we later found out is that Tommy was adopted and that when it came to his biological family, he didn't know about them until he became 18. And while Lily was in a relationship with Tommy, it wasn't until last year of December that around this time is when his biological sister, who we'll call Grace, decided to reach out to him. Now at that time, guys, Lily felt like something was off about the biological sister, Grace, but she didn't know how to explain it. She didn't want to ruin the relationship that she had with Tommy because she really wanted to be supportive. Now at this point in the relationship, guys, Lily and Tommy are now living together and he started acting weird and Lily sure enough started noticing that. Like for example, Tommy kept constantly texting Grace, which isn't weird, but one thing that Lily noticed that was so weird about Tommy is that he would frantically try to hide what was going on on his phone. Now at this point, Lily tries to defend herself by saying that she isn't the type to be insecure, that she never was the type to go through somebody's phone. She never had a reason to. Furthermore, she said that she never really had concrete proof of Tommy and Grace actually hooking up. She just had a feeling at that time. So now several months later passed, guys, and now it's April 2024, close to their one year anniversary of dating. Lily and Tommy are home alone. They're on the couch and Tommy proceeds to tell Lily that he has to go to the ATM to go grab some cash. So he decides to leave. But as Tommy leaves the door, he ends up leaving his phone on the table, which then Lily has this gut-wrenching feeling to go through his phone, and she does. And guys, it is bad. And this is actual pictures of the conversation. I love the feeling of my brother's hot and steamy poured on my skin. Just wait till it's inside of you, he says. Oh my gosh. At this moment, guys, Lily's shocked. In fact, she's screaming, she's crying, completely freaking out. So she decides to pack her stuff and Lily decides to call her mom to come pick her up. And at this point, she's done. She packs her stuff in the back of her mom's car and they leave. Now fast forward guys, at this point, Lily ends up taking a picture of all of the conversations between Tommy and Grace. Some of them to which had pictures of his actual face like this, this is actually real and she decides to send it to Tommy's actual parents. Lily talks to their parents on the phone and tells them what happens. How she said, your son is having intercourse with your daughter. But the parents yell and scream at Lily and they call her a liar and that she's crazy. So then a couple days pass after the incident that happened and she's talking to her mom. And somewhere within the conversation, Lily decides to convince herself that she should make an actual police report because apparently Tommy is 19 and Grace is actually 17, which makes her underage. So, oh yeah, she really does go make a police report. And what happens is CPS ends up getting involved because of this, guys. And if you were to ask what's happening right now, apparently the reason why she posted this is that she just wants to cope with her trauma. This was her first ever relationship. But if you guys would like to go see the video for yourself, it's right here, guys. I mean, honestly, what is your thoughts about this?